Hey, what's up? Billy Sebeko here. Landry Wilcox, she just took second at the Tennessee State Meet, 18.05. Talk about today. Um, yeah, it was really exciting. I mean, it hasn't really been the best season just with COVID and everything, but I'm glad we were able to get out here and have a fun race. Yeah, they made it happen. It's not a steeplechase, which is a historic course. Uh, what was the difference today, and you know, did you not mind it, or what was your thoughts on that? Um, yeah, it felt pretty fast in comparison to steeplechase, just not like the long, drawn-out hills. Um, the two laps was a little different, but I kind of liked it. It's getting you ready for uh, college because actually that's what they do at Nationals for that 10K for the guys. They'll go through two loops. So it's getting you, it's getting you ready for that. Um, so you're going to Tennessee next year, huh? Yeah. So Foster was one of my old, I guess, teammates. So say hi to Ryan Foster. <laughs> yeah. um, how excited are you for that and when, what went into that decision? Yeah, I'm really pumped. Um, I think it was just like the team environment, the coaches, really everything about it. Just everyone seemed really excited, motivated to do well. So awesome. I'm excited to join. Did you always want to stay in the state? Is that big to you? I mean, that's kind of like the big school in this state, you know? Um, I mean, I wasn't really ever planning on it, but, you know, yeah. things happen. Cool. So what are you looking forward to, you know, the rest of the year? I know it's a COVID year and all that things, but what are some things you're trying to focus on? Um, you know, staying strong, healthy, being ready for college. Um, if we get a track season, I'll be excited to get some races in, but yeah, yeah just running well. Yeah. So it, it, some people look at it as like they want to check a lot of things off through their senior year, but some people, they can take a deep breath because, you know, all the recruiting process is gone. You kind of done a lot of cool things. You proved yourself um, and you're ready for the next level. Which one are you thinking? Um, a little bit of both, maybe? Yeah. I mean, look to have fun, you know, like my last few races, just make them count. Cool. What are you focusing on this year? What race, like, on, in track? 32, I think. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, cool. What's one fun fact about yourself, non-running related? Um, I used to live in New Mexico. Hey, <laughs> I love it there. I love it there. What, uh, what's your pump-up song you listened to before the race today? A song? Uh... <laughs> you didn't listen to any music? No. <laughs> oh, no music. All right. Uh, what was your pre-race food? Um, a rice cake with peanut butter and banana. Okay, okay, not bad. <laughs> nice and simple. Um, let's see. Do you have any superstitions? Did you have to do anything like tie your left shoe before your right? Uh, I mean, I always wear my lucky socks. What are they? What are they? American flag. Hey, red, <laughs> white, and blue, baby. Love it, love it. Uh, let's see. Any questions for me? Um, what's been your favorite race to go to this year? This year? Uh, you're putting me on the spot now. I loved the Ed Murphy Classic was fun. And I also liked that uh, meet that they had the Music at Distance Carnival was probably cool. Mill Rose was cool. That's technically this year still. So those are probably my three top three. Good question. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yep. <laughs>